And uh, is everyone familiar with the technique? Which one again? I'm sorry. All right, let's check out that one. On the uh, side. Oh, oh yeah. Okay. Some people haven't seen it yet. Yeah. So I think this is very common uh, defense position where we are trying to bridge the. Uh, Technique. So what I'm doing, I'll, I'll just uh, lift a little bit up. I'll take a grip from uh, from from the opposite side uh, color, and uh, then I just roll low, roll over here. And when Uke is on top of me, I use my other foot to go on under under here and. I'll just lift him over, and and uh, when I'm here, I uh, uh, constantly I, I I don't let the grip go from this hand. I just use my head uh, to pin the, the the hand here, and then I beat my other hand with the with the color. So so once I have the upper body in a in a nice package, uh, I, I'll start working with my foot which is here. Okay usually holds it up. There's a few ways of releasing the the foot. Um, you can uh, it kind of depends on the okay and yourself how what, what you can do. Uh, what I like usually like to do is is to roll on on the other side like this and then I can use my I don't know if you, you don't see it from there you gotta go from the other side I'll, I'll use my other foot to release my my uh, my uh, my my knee out from there and when I have my knee out of there I'll roll over again one more time like this and then release it. Okay. Oh, I'll, I'll show you. There's a few steps here. So lift, creep from the other other side, roll over here, take the foot here, step over, and don't release at any times. This hand. Get on top of the okay. Uh, well, if you have the both hands like this, it's fine. <laughs> Usually you don't. But the important thing is that you use your head like this. Then fit the, uh, the other hand with the color and then work with your, with your uh, leg. Sometimes I just take the grip from here and, 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 and just move the feet on the other side and then just right away do this and then kick. And then like this. Uh, important thing here is is that you keep your hip down, and so that uh, uh, you have a, you have a right weight position in here. I think the common problem is that you have your self up here, and then usually you don't have that to come on the hook, and hook can move over. So put your hip on the tummy and you're able to hold him down nicely. Okay. One more time. Just this. Yeah. Yeah, there's a few steps here. So here, flip, opposing collar, roll over, and then take the, uh, the foot and lift over right away get on top of the okay and then start working with the upper body never do anything with your feet until your upper body is in control because when you have your upper body in control then you have the other other hand helping here you don't necessarily have to do anything with the other and you can also just place it here to lock yourself in this position and then you can just 
to lift yourself and pick yourself out of there. Either way, you kind of feel comfortable with. I, I often like to, uh, when it's really tight, somebody has a really tight uh, uh, hole on my leg, I just work this way that I just release my, my knee first and then, then release my ankle. That's the last thing I think. And then you're here. Okay. Oh. <sighs> I wanted to go. <laughs> <laughs> okay.